Well, I can't believe it. I was talking for 15, 20 minutes and batteries were dead. That's why that's why this thing went off. I thought that's because the memory chip was full. Okay, you can see here I replaced the the broken the broken plastic part with a paper clip going into the into the uh in the hole, but I went up through the hole instead of down through the hole, so it's in the wrong spot. Push it out right. Let's see. So I'm going to have to dig, tank with this again some more. But it works. It's fixed. Basically, it's fixed. Well, it's taped together right now. I have to untape it, put the paper clip back in there right, and then tape it up again but the paper pushes it out by itself it pushes the glide out by itself and it runs. the printer pushes the paper out the paper glide out by itself because it's got less weight on it. That bolt right there. This bolt here. We should have been able to pull paper out with just too much weight for the for that piece of paper to push it out. Push the glide out. So now what am I gonna do? I'm gonna take that piece of tape off this used to tilt down, but now we'll do that because the spring was holding it apart. The spring of the plastic was holding it apart. The, the pivots are on, and that's and one of them's busted. That's why we have a paper clip in there. And there's a Daywall drill that I used, similar to the one I'm sawing, but not exactly the same. The one that I have has got, the one I'm selling I think has little lights on it, so you can, so you don't have to take flashlights in five different places so you can see when you're drawing. I did on this one, which most daylight jobs outside it doesn't make any difference, but doing little dinky stuff like this, it's, it helps. Or if you're coming in and out of the dark and your eyes can't adjust quick enough, you turn on the flashlight and it's turn the drill and it's trying some light on there. That, that helps. I had that rigged up just on top of a, of a uh, stapler so that it would do right angle on it. And we've got all these lights on in the house. I can see. And I'm going to put this back on the tripod now. This really is pretty much over. Well, I'm going to put it on the tripod until I put the base on it. So I guess I'm going to. There's the base of the camera that I'm going to put it on so it will go there. There's my battery charging back up. Okay, that's going to call it quits for the day.